Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com, and I'm here to show you how to play our game Math Boat Rounding to the Nearest 100. If you're not familiar with MathNook, we feature free math games to play, logic games, puzzle games, as well as teaching tools and worksheets. Okay, so when you first start the game, you see the menu here, and you have the option of starting the game or how to play. If you click how to play, it you can read the instructions on how to play in case you forget how to play uh, after this video. Let's go ahead and start the game, and here you're going to see the play field. And the object of the game is to take the boat here, avoid any obstacles, and go and get each of these life preservers. There's one underneath here that you can barely see. that will eventually be cleared away once I click Start. And you control the boat by these green arrows here. Now, it's rounding the nearest 10, 100, I'm sorry, and you'll control so you'll have to round these numbers to the nearest hundred uh, for the direction you want to go so when I start out the boat will go straight and at this point I'm gonna to want to go left so I'll need to um, put in uh, what this number rounds to here in the left arrow which is 800 772 to the nearest hundred is 800 and then I'll hit either click this enter button here or hit the enter key on the keyboard. Now what I'll actually do is, is put the number in advance um, and then hit the enter when I enter key when I want it to go that direction. So let me go ahead and show you how that works. I'm going to go ahead and click start and as soon as it starts I'm going to plug in 800. So 800 is in there which is matches this number here and as soon as it gets here I'm going to go ahead and click this button here and it goes left. Now I'm going to go down in a minute that number also rounds to 800 so I'm going to go ahead and put that in and when I want it to go down I'm going to go ahead and click this button here I'm going to go ahead and pick up this coin here got it the coins give you extra points now I want it to go left in a minute so 457 rounds to 500 go ahead and hit enter now once we get the last preserver then a little parking spot is going to show up here and, and I'm going to have to go to that to park it. So 763 rounds to 800. Hit enter. And it's got to be between these four points. I'm not sure if I made it, but I think I did. Let's see. So the level is clear. You move on to the next level. Now this level um, plays pretty much the same. It has a few more obstacles. You see the island here, and it has these uh, stumps that you need to avoid. Um, also, this tells you how many parts you have and how many little preservers you've gotten. So I, I, I've, we've already played the first level so I'm going to go ahead and just go to the end of the game. I'm going to do that by crashing the boat. So 576 rounds to 600. Hit enter. And you notice the, the life goes down to 2 here. And go ahead and click just again to start. And it's this number here rounds to 800. I'm going to go ahead and go right. And last but not least, 621 rounds to 600. Enter, and that should, should be game over. So when the game ends, you get this little menu here that says try again or more games. I'll just take you back to Math Nook. Uh, let's go ahead and say click try again. And at this point, I can um, enter my name in the high score table and put Tommy in here. If you don't want to do that, you can just click X. But I want to, so I'm going to go ahead and submit, click Submit, and you can see that I have the highest score so far. Um, if there's more scores than fit on the screen, you can scroll through them by clicking the right or uh, down or up arrow. Go ahead and close this. And the next screen is the email challenge screen, and I can actually uh, send an email to a friend um, to let them know that I like this game and, and it, it, it and w that I got a good score on it and kind of bra brag a little bit about it and it will cont it'll send an email saying what, your, what the score you got uh, what the score was and then it'll also have a link to the game so they can play it also and see if they can beat your score and at this point you would just uh, type in the, your friend's email address and let's just go ahead and put this in uh, at Math and I would click submit and it'll actually send an email to your friend um, if you don't want to do that, just click X and you go back to the main menu. I hope this helped you, and I hope you have fun playing the game. Thanks for watching.